Hello everybody. My name's Michael Scott. I'm a photographer on fineartamerica.com and uh, I've been putting a lot of images online lately and I've come across something I thought was pretty cool I wanted to share with everybody. It's uh, creating a collection set, specifically a smart collection set using keywording in your images. So I'm going to show you how this works but in short basically what it allows you to do is uh, once you've taken an image and you process your image in Lightroom um, by adding keywording here, you can see the keywording tags, what this will do for you is uh, by using smart folders, once you've created your image and put the, the keywording in it, it will automatically take the image and place it in the correct folder under your smart collection. So we'll take this image here, for example, of uh, Lakiji Rock in Kentucky, and I place those keywords in here, uh, like the location Kentucky. So what I want to do is I'm going to come over here to the Smart Collection and I'm going to create, and we'll get you back here to the beginning from the collections. What, what you would normally do is by clicking the plus symbol here, you could create your Smart Collection. What I'm going to do is I'm going to create a Smart Collection set. What this is, this allows me to create a folder, in this case called Locations, and have subfolders underneath the locations such as states or countries or however you choose to do this. So I'm going to put the locations inside a collection set under my already existing smart collections. So I'll create that and then you can see what it's done. It's created my locations folder. So by clicking on the locations folder now what I want to do is right click that and I'm going to go ahead and create smart collection. Now I'm going to name this in this particular case, we'll call this Kentucky. And then you can see what's going under the location set, which is where I want it to go. So what I'm going to have this do is match any of the following rules. I'll delete this one. So by selecting keywords, and you can find that under other metadata and keywords, I can select contains contains all or contains words. In this case I'll put contains. And I'll put in here the word Kentucky. If I, I could do multiple states, I could do Kentucky and Virginia or whatever I want to type in here. In this case I'm just going to make these folders for individual states starting with Kentucky. And I'll hit create. Now, once I hit create, any image that I already have existing that has a keyword Kentucky in it is automatically going to populate my locations folder. So as you can see, now I have the Kentucky folder under my locations. So I have my Kentucky smart folder, which is automatically looking for any image that has the word Kentucky in the keywording. And it's that easy. So I could go back to locations. I'll do one more. Just right click your locations, create the smart collection, or excuse me, go back to locations, right click, create smart collection, and in this case I'll type in another state, and I can select the keywording contains, and we'll go ahead and type in Virginia again. This may seem like a lot of work, but it's really not because once you get this going it's really awesome so now I got the two states in here you could break this down we could do countries I could have countries a country subfolder inside the location with various countries or states or however I want to do this And you can really see how, how awesome this is to organize your library and what it'll really do is by having these uh, smart collections and these collection sets it's really going to cut down on the number of folders that, that you have under your smart collection. So that's it. Pretty easy. Creating uh, locations with states uh, where, or however you want to do it. But uh, the key wording is the key. That's the way I like to organize my library. So I hope you got something out of this.